talk about this market today here because again, yesterday, markets were down a lot. <laughs> yesterday, 80 points on the S&P 500, really cracking through this very important support level. This is really the first time that we've had a serious break below the 200 day moving average. We've done it before back in 15, 16, um, but the environment was a little bit different then as we were coming in, of course, with Brexit, those type of issues. Central banks came in rushing to the rescue that helped bail out the markets in 2015, 2016, which should have likely been a much deeper correction. We are now going through that same type of corrective process, breaking very important support at the 200 day moving average. We retested it, failed and went to new lows. Now this is a confirmation of a weaker mark environment, one you wanna be very, very careful of right now in particular. Today's rally is not the beginning of the next bull rally. This is going to be a sellable rally. We were down 80 points yesterday on heavy volume. We rallied today up about 49, 50 points on the S&P right here at the close, but not even enough to retrace basically half of yesterday's loss uh, from peak to trough. So again, be very careful here. This is an opportunity to begin raising some cash. Today, we started lifting some positions out of the portfolio, very little. And as this market keeps rallying back towards this 2750 level, 2750 is going to be key here. Uh, a rally back there that fails is very likely going to entail another leg down in the market. So we're going to be talking more about this in just a moment with Michael Leibowitz, CFA. We're also going to be talking tonight with Richard Rosso and John Camarianos about risk volatility and how that measures up in your portfolio and why you should navigate that much more carefully and what it means. That's all coming up today on Lance Roberts show right here at realinvestmentadvice.com. Don't go away. <laughs> 